combat. I'm gonna swing both these guys at you. So this is only my second time playing Oathbreaker uh, here in Chicago. I learned at MagicCon Las Vegas where I got to support Magic Kids as a volunteer. And it's been a lot of fun. I think it is a really interesting way to give players a, a different format on large decks to play with and get be more creative. 10, I'm gonna gain 10. Uh, and then there's one, two, three, four, five. Two disc triggers, which are all going at you, and two double triggers, which are also going at you. I think the Oathbreaker format is actually a very fun format. It is kind of interesting to see the versatility of kind of like how you can take old designs as well as the new designs with specific of Planeswalkers as well as their signature spells and just find unique little synergies to help complement each other. Yeah, I'll swing three over at you. It's nice, quick, and to the point. Every deck that I have been able to get my hands on has been really fun twist on a commander style that is much faster and there's a little less um, digging to figure out what your deck is doing that has to happen, <laughs> which is nice. I love the format. Uh, I stream it every every month, once a month. I love the fast-pacedness of it, the, the, the signature spells and seeing what people can cook up with different Planeswalkers. Take your favorite card, like look at your favorite Planeswalker. And then just think about, look at like spells that can help complement the why you like playing that Planeswalker in general. And then just start from there. It could just be as simple as just a Jace and a Ponder. If you like it like that. Or it could even be as complicated as the new Kaya with a graveyard spell. Oh, and it copies, so I copy, so I actually get another trick. With the format how it is, uh, the 60 cards and 20 life, it's really easy to explain and play multiple games. You gotta go away. The Oathbreaker community is very nice and welcoming. They do help out with a variety of introductory kind of like uh, suggestions of how to start with like your basic Planeswalker as well as what would be a good complimentary signature spell. But also it's just fun to see every community's unique little spark on it. Their little taste of how they make something unique that help either complement their play style or complement like their persona, their calling card is the saying goes. I play with a lot of Oathbreaker uh, players. Uh, we just enjoy throwing random planeswalkers and signature spells and see if they work and uh, try to critique them and play as much as we can. Try to jam as many games as you can after work. <laughs> this format is a cup splendid and it's uh, I would highly recommend it for people to try it out and just uh, see the unique shenanigans that it can provide. It's been really fun. I, it speeds it up. It's a good way to see different cards that you wouldn't normally see in other formats. I think it's a lot of fun. Love the format and I can't wait to see how farther along it goes.